So yeah, this is a unusual start to the week, but uh, that's the way it's going, and we'll see what happens. Oh lord, um... Yeah, this is interesting. Um, and the rain's not letting up. So, uh, my week's starting, and hopefully we do not have to use the boat that we just broke down right now. Here's the backyard. And yeah, that's um pretty flooded. And our broken down boat. <clears throat> that got kind of stripped. <clears throat> kind of funny, the people who stripped it down last week, I was joking with them that, well, if a flood comes, uh, I'm not going to have a useful boat anymore because it's got all the holes in it now. Joking, not realizing less than a week later that, uh, yeah, that's the case. <laughs> They're almost the case. Anyway, thank goodness our gardens are raised over there, so they'll stay above whatever, uh, whatever's up here. Just crazy. Just crazy. See, look, you got crickets. They're like leaping up here. See? Crickets are trying to avoid all the flooding. Wow. Just look. It's like right up on our doorstep. Right there, sidewalk, and then the street right ahead of it. Ahead of it. That is crazy. Uh. Hey, Manfred. Manfred, what's going on out there, buddy? Huh? It's like a world of water, and you're scared to death of water. So, what are you gonna do? What if during the night the water comes up and attacks you? If it can come up to the yard, it can come up to the house. Mm -hmm. What are you gonna do, buddy? What are you gonna do? Manfred. Manfred. What's out there, buddy? Huh?
Okay, so it's been a few hours. It's getting dark, as you can tell. <clears throat> but so far, the water hasn't receded. Here, I'll show you. It's actually gotten a little bit higher. Um, although it has stopped raining, it did stop raining, so that's good. But and you see out there, I mean, it's just, it's all water out there. Coming up in the car too, but I don't think it should flood the car, so we'll just have to see what it's like in the morning. So right now, just I did this flood. Good night. Okay, it's the following morning from the um, one, the original flooding of the street, or the one this, when the street turned into a river. And as you can see, the water has pretty much receded away from this area. Thank goodness. So a couple of puddles, but overall, no, no, no flood. Although I've heard that there are still areas, like on the highways and such, that they're still flooding. I actually plan to go out this morning to the post office, so we'll see what it's like out there. Pretty interesting past, uh, what, 20 hours it's been. <laughs> uh, but anyway, we'll see what it's like outside this neighborhood. Okay, so, walk the roads, the streets, and the areas that were probably flooded before. Yesterday evening, last night, aren't so much now. I think the only areas that are really flooded are the uh, like low-level highway areas, which are still causing like major backups in traffic. As you can see behind me, <clears throat> uh, the traffic is pretty much going in that this section of road. They're going just about as fast as me walking, so not very fast. <laughs> uh, but I mean, hopefully, for the end of the day. Everything else will be dried up and everything will go back to normal and we'll just consider this the major flood of 2014.